Hello there everybody, Emrix here with probably my last uh, LEGO City update for a while. This is just all the stuff I already had built. So here's the story for my LEGO City in case you don't already know it. I started it in like September of uh, 2018. So it's been over a year now and it has been fun. I've been building a lot and mm, well, I've been wanting to do like, you know, like uh, I've always had the plan since I started the city to have the YouTube channel. Like I was like, oh, I'll build a toy store and then do a video on it and stuff like that. But um, I had a principle where I had to review all this before I could show my city. So I was building as I was reviewing and stuff like that. And um, right here with the everything uh, here, I've already shown in videos, hopefully, and the kind of construction mock down below. But um, yeah, and I ha do have two more kind of buggies down there, but I don't have a place to put them with the others. So it would be way too crowded. But anyway, I'm getting sidetracked. Um, this is actually something that is work in progress. And... That was something I really missed out on, showing you like my work on the toy store, my work on the McDonald's, slowly by slowly, giving updates. Uh, but now I can because I am, I have this uh, work in progress um, <clears throat> amusement park. I am a budget builder, so all the pieces uh, you should be seeing on screen now. Yeah, just a lot of weird colors. Those are all from the, um, they used to be in these stilts, but then I ordered those pieces and traded them out. Like, I make it with weird pieces, then, uh, <clears throat> sorry, I have a cold, but then when I have the pieces I need, then I order them and trade them out. So, yeah, let's, uh, it's three and a half base plates, and there's a secret project down there I can't show you yet. That's all I can show you down below in the table. And I'm probably going to submit it to Lego Ideas once I get a lot of uh, subscribers. Uh, for a reason, I'll tell you then. But anyway, here is the entrance. And that, I'm really happy how I got that. It looks like a kind of um, a circus. Yeah, it really looks like a circus, in my opinion. This uses a handful of pieces. And there's the back of that mock. And you know, I'm going to do a full walkthrough once this thing is done. This is just kind of quick. Beyond that, I have a ticket booth. It says ticket, two lights. I have shaggy. I just bring in stand in figures. I'm going to replace those with custom figures and when you remove the roof, again, weird colors, going to have to order the other ones. However, two cash machines and a bunch of those 1x2 printed ticket, very useful uh, printed ticket uh, pieces. And the thing I'm working on is going to go here. Well, I'm working on all of this, but the thing I'm especially working on, and it's almost done. Anyway, here are the kind of beams and little place maybe for figures to sit. Uh, I actually took inspiration off IMG, but anyway, you got um, these pieces are going to have to be chained out, but this is so cool. This is the roller coaster piece, track pieces, upside down. <laughs> yeah, I got a way to put them all upside down. And you can see here, you can attach a track, a cart, and each of these kind of carts, there will be two total on the track will contain two seats and there I have one seat. These are one of the rides where your legs would be dangling it. And I'm just so happy with how that came out. I do have to make it more structural though. It keeps falling apart, but uh, we'll see how that uh, works out. Here I got a little cotton candy mock, um, very much in progress. I have a bunch of these beehive pieces, which I'm happy to get in pink. And that is work in progress. And next to it, an ice cream freezer. Just, you know, I'm gonna do a more in-depth uh, work. This is. Just so that when I show you, oh, I traded out these pieces, you're like, traded them out with what? So uh, watch this video and then you'll know. So, but the full in-depth uh, walkthrough will come later. That's a very, very much uh, work in progress. Well, this all is, but this is such a, it's one of those rides where you sit here, the thing spins upside down, like two different types of spin, like the whole module spins, and then this seat spin itself. Also based off, I'm, you know, I built from uh, my experiences. But anyway, here's the other cart that I have to add chairs to and kind of put there. These have to be raised up a bit, but this is um, another booth, got a popcorn machine, um, drink fountain, and a nice slushy right there. Uh, let's see what else we got. So that should be it for one base plate. And this I've been working on since um, the beginning of 2018. No, no, 2018, whoa. Yeah, yeah, I started uh, 2018. September, I believe it was. Yeah, yeah, 2018 September. So I've been working on this, I believe, since. Uh, sorry, I'm getting a bit stuck here. No. Oh, yeah, yeah. See, I messed up. I've um, I started this city a long time ago. Now, actually, 
in 2017 September, not 2018 September. So yeah, 2017 September. I started this at the beginning of 2018. Did all of that before that. Yeah, I was working hard before that. But anyway, uh, because I had a lot of pieces. But anyway, that is one base plate. So yeah, started this 2017 September. Started this beginning of 2018. But anyway, uh, back there we have a kind of operating booth for the roller coaster and a line, a three track roller coaster. We just have Hermione. It goes up this way around the water raft ride and down just a circle very basic um whoa i just knocked down uh, one of my roller coaster setups don't worry uh this isn't going to be here it's just watch a uh, search embrix roller coaster setup and you'll uh, know what i do i just make these for fun so i don't care about that i had to take it apart anyway but anyway uh we have uh, this thing it's one of those drop rides it's going to be like this tall very tall all right this tall so yeah, I'm working on that, a lot of things. Um, and then here's the last thing I'll show you uh, for now. It is the kind of uh, river rafting. So you'll come up uh, these kind of stone uh, designed steps. Here's the line with some wood, some caution, and then you get onto these. These are very nice builds. I use the huge uh, tires. I have, hmm, uh, you know, the plain pieces at the front that turn a lot here. <sighs> one of those pieces like that but it has four attached i use that put it in the middle sorry about the bad camera but just got attached the last chair i put that in the middle and then attach four chairs that's how that works out uh, it's going to be jungle themed going to have some trees have a black panther there just for show animatronics mm, this is the place where it would swirl around the bridge was originally going to be here but then i was like wait it has to be there <laughs> so that they can actually uh have access and there's a little place where it goes up and then drops and the crocodile animatronic or alligator will splash on you. But um, yeah, so this is what I'm working on. Um, I'm going to be showing updates. Um, probably not that frequently because um, right after the city, I got to review all these minifigures, do the studio tour and then pack up because I am moving uh, near the summer, maybe Mayish. But yeah, wow, this... I'm bad at estimating. Like, I thought that this would take me a whole month to review if I rushed. It only took me four days to review all this Lego City stuff uh, of my Mock City, uh, which Mock stands for my creation. It only took me four days. So maybe it's because it took so long to build that, you know, I really overestimated, but it's gonna be, it's gonna take so long to pack. I'm gonna have to make video. Uh, kind of diaries to myself. I'm not gonna publish them, definitely not, to myself of how to build this so that um, so that I'll know um, how to build it when I move and then I can pack all the pieces in separate Ziploc bags. But wow, I've already finished showing you guys my Lego City. But yeah, after showing you the Lego City and reviewing that stuff, uh, doing the studio tour, then I'm gonna pack up. But that is it for this video. And I hope you liked it, please subscribe. Leave a comment down below and I should be talking to you again soon with that. And by the way, uh, after moving, uh, my YouTube channel is going to start up again. Not just because I packed up. I'm going to show you how I unpack. I'm going to show you how I pack. And then I'm going to be continuing to do more videos hopefully. So yeah, that's it for now. Bye.